Hello there, Matt here with TranscriptionGear.tv, brought to you by the super site, TranscriptionGear.com. We have all your recording and transcribing solutions ready for same-day shipping. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Gear Tools product, Gear Dictate. Gear Dictate is one of the most advanced dictation softwares available on the market today. Put simply, it's a PC-based software that turns your computer into a dictation station. It allows for you to record with a microphone and have full foot control support for hands-free dictation. Now, Gear Dictate has gone through some major improvements and been redesigned. So let's go ahead and hop in and take a look and see what's been done. Gear Dictate 4 has undergone some major improvements to its user interface. It has a new design that's never been seen before. Now, we're going to go more in depth than this later, but I wanted to give you a little preview so you can get excited about this new software that's really powerful, but still easy to use. As you can see, Gear Dictate now has a progress bar in the middle, easy to use playback controls on the bottom, and we put vital functions at the top so they're just a click away. This will allow you to work easily and more efficiently. Now that's what I call a gorgeous user interface. Now don't you find it bothersome when you need to think about something while you're dictating, but you don't want to pause your dictation? Well, no longer will you have to. Check out this feature. Gear Dictate's new silence detection wizard cuts out all periods of silence in your dictation automatically. It allows users to set up their microphone to record only when they are speaking. This feature is even more exciting as it's easy to set up. Just go to Options and turn on this feature. So we just go to Tools, Adjust Audio Controls, it brings up the Control Panel, and you would choose Enable Silence Detection. Once you have it enabled, you can choose exactly how much background noise you want to filter out. You can actually even preview it from right here. Now as you just saw, silence is detected and it automatically stops recording when voice is no longer being heard. All you need to do now is just go ahead and hit save. Alright, silence detection. I'm telling you it's awesome. It makes transcription easier by taking out unnecessary silence. But, we can still make it easier. Check this out, hands-free dictation. Just get yourself a compatible foot control and a microphone. Here, take a look. Alright, you've got yourself a compatible foot control and a nice microphone like a gooseneck, so you're good to go. Once your foot control is hooked up, it can be customized to let you start new dictations, pause recording, or even mark a file as priority. This amazing ability will allow you to keep productive and working at your station, but you'll still be able to dictate with ease. Now I understand sometimes you need to be able to glance at the software to see what your status is on a file. With Gear Dictate comes a new feature called Large Display Mode. Simply turn this feature on under the Options menu, and everything will become crystal clear from a glance. So now we can dictate hands-free. Are you a person always on the go? With Gear Dictate's mobile licensing technology, no longer are you bound to work at one station. This allows you to use any computer anywhere. Just simply take your USB license key with you, plug it into the computer, and now Gear Dictate can work. Now something that I find bothersome is checking for updates for software on the web. Well, no longer will you have to. With Gear Dictate, just simply click on Help and choose Check for Updates, or tell a software to do it for you automatically. The feature we're going to take a look at though now is called Notifications. It allows you to see the status of your dictation at a glance. So let's take a look. These new features will allow you to see the status of your dictation. Are you hands-free and not near your computer to see your status? These pop-up notifications show statuses such as at start, at end, pause, record, etc. Even the system tray icon changes color depending on what you are doing. Gear Dictate even gives you audio notifications. It comes with pre-recorded audio for your choosing or you can make your own. These audio prompts go hand in hand with the pop-up notifications. Do you find yourself dictating the same thing over and over like a routine procedure or checkup? Well, no longer will you have to with Gear Dictate's audio templates. Just save a routine recording as a template and now you can insert it anywhere. Let's take a look. Alright, so you want to see how audio templates works. Well, this is really easy. You just take a routine audio recording you may have, like a checkup or a standard procedure. And once you have it dictated, you just go ahead and stop your dictation. And you hit File, Save as Template. It's going to prompt you to put a name in for it, so we're going to go ahead and say Test. Hit OK. Now, at any point in time in your recording, if you have a recording that you need to insert this template into, just go ahead and go to Edit insert template and hit your template. It inserts it and there we go. Now it just put that template into my recording for me. 
Now Gear Dictate 4's Routing Wizard, what is it? It's a utility that allows you to automatically move your completed dictations to an email, FTP site, or local area network. How does this help? You no longer have to deal with the busy work of moving files, tapes, etc. You can have your files automatically routed for you, saving you time and allowing you to be more productive. Let me show you how this works. Alright, so we're all done dictating now and we need to send our file off. So all you have to do is mark your dictation as complete, save dictation as complete, and when it does that, it prompts you for your file destination. Now, I have three destinations set up here. My default route, my transcription is Jill, and if I need to, for off-site locations, I can email them as well. You just simply click it and it sends the dictation off for you and now you're ready to dictate again. Okay, so we looked at the user interface earlier, but what does it really have to offer? has a new oscilloscope so you can tell when audio is actually being recorded, the progress bar so you can easily move around your dictation. You can even add text notes to your dictation that can be passed along to transcription with the Gear Player software. So let's go ahead and hop in and take a look at some of these more in-depth features. So let's take a look at some of the more in-depth functions here on the advanced user interface. The first thing we're going to look at here is the progress bar. As you can see right now, we've got the oscilloscope going, so it tells me and shows me that audio is actually being recorded right now. But when I don't have record mode set, it gives me an advanced waveform analyzation right here. This is your progress bar. This will allow you to easily jump around your dictation, depending on where you need to be in your dictation. You can see right here with silence, and then I was actually speaking here. This will allow you to quickly jump around your dictation. Now down here in the bottom right, you have a demographics window. If you have demographic information set for your file, it will show it down here. Gear Dictate 4 gives you a lot of customization on your demographics. Also, if you need to add a text note to your dictation, just simply click where you want to go and hit insert text. Pops up a bubble and you can type in whatever you need to type. Now, when you mark this as complete, it puts it in there just like that. These text notes can be handed off to transcription with the Gear Player software. Functions such as marking a file priority, editing the demographic informations, inserting your templates, leaving a files open, or even starting a new dictation are all now easily at your hands with this new toolbar that puts those vital functions just a click away. All right, last but not least, the foot pedal testing utility. This allows you to test your foot pedal to see if it's a hardware or software related issue. Let's see it. The foot pedal testing utility. Just simply go to Tools, Options, go to the Foot Pedal tab, and from here you have your options. A generic USB, a DAC USB, generic serial, DAC serial, or a four-function foot pedal. Simply click on Test Foot Pedal, and it'll pop up your foot pedal tester. Now, when you press buttons on your foot control, as you can see, it lights up red, letting you know that your foot pedal is actually working. Hardware or software, everything seems to be working just fine. All right, unfortunately, that's all the time I have for today. But don't worry, if you'd like to get some more information on this, feel free to stop by our website, www.transcriptiongear.com, or give us a call. Myself or one of my friends would be glad to assist you. Our number is 1-888-834-2392. Well, once again, Matt here with TranscriptionGear.tv, signing out.